Hello, welcome to Data Engineer YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn the basic of SQL so that we can just start with SQL. So those who have, uh, you know, are new to like SQL language, definitely go for this video. And I will be creating the entire playlist from where you can like start from the basic and you will go to the advanced level. So let's get started for the today's video. In the previous video, I just told you like how we can take the, uh, you know, take the backup of a sample database and how we can use it, right? So I'm, I will be using the same database. So if you have not watched that video, just watch it. It's the first video of the playlist. Just go and watch it and then you can come to this video, right? Now the first task, uh, you know, is to, you know, create a connection in SSMS. What you need to do is, in the left hand side, if you connect to the server, so this is my local server, so I may have multiple databases inside my server. So these are the multiple databases, right? So now, in the previous video, we saw how we can, you know, install this AdventureWorks LTI, which is the light edition of 2019. Uh, so we checked it out. So what you need to do is, you need to right click on it. Uh, so once you right click, you just need to click on new query. So once you click on new query, so you will see this area to be white and you can write queries here. All right. So the first uh, sample statement which we can write is of select star, right? But for that, you need to know the tables, what all tables you have in this database, which is AdventureWorks LT 2019. So I will click on this plus icon. Once I click on this plus icon, you can see multiple folders and one of the folder is tables. You will get to know like what are these other folders in upcoming videos. So as of now, uh, we will see, uh, you know, the different tables we have. So you can see like these are the tables which we have. Let's say I want to query this table. So I can simply write select. Let's say I want to, you know, fetch out all the columns present in this, uh, you know, table. So I use asterisk sign, which we call star also, select star from the table name. So what's the table name? Sales LT dot customer. So I'll copy it and I'll just paste it. So I just need to tell the uh, you know schema name also which is sales LT. So sales LT dot customer. Okay. So you can see earlier it was red. Now it is uh, you know not red. Red means there is some error. So you know in SQL there is some intelligence uh, going on in the back end. So it tells you whether this table is present or not. If it is not present, it will be underlined with a red symbol. Now, if I just, uh, you know, uh, execute it by clicking on this icon, so you will see this table. Okay. So this is very basic, a select, simple select query. Now, I will tell you about shortcuts which you can use in day-to-day -day life, which are very important. So simply, you need not to click on this execute. What you can do is you can select the command and you can just press F5. F5 is also to execute. Now let's say I have two statements. So let's say I have one statement called select start from sales.customer and then I have, uh, uh, you know, select query from sales. Dot, let's say product. Okay. So firstly I want to execute this only. So I'll select this and I'll press F5. So the first statement will get executed. Uh, if I want to say, you know, execute the second, I'll select this. And I can just press F5. So my second table will get executed. If I want to execute both, I will I can select both and I can press F5. So both will get executed and you can see both the table. So this is the first query result table and the second this is the second query table result. First and second. Right? So F5 is the shortcut, you need to remember it. Now, very important. Let's say I want to see the schema of this table. Okay, schema means the columns, what are the column name. You can also see it from here also, but you don't know what's the type, data type of this column. Then you want to you know, know it, uh, like you need to know the metadata of this table. So what you can do is you can just press Alt F1. By you know, selecting the table, you just need to press Alt F1. Very important. And you will get the uh, metadata, like I have a column called product ID. The data type is integer, the length is 4, right? And the number of you can see things, details you can get to know, right? So this is this is very important, like if you want to see, you know, you want to perform joins, which we will see in the upcoming video. I, that's all for this video. I hope you 
found this video useful so i covered the shortcut tricks also so that you know for day to day life it is easy for you to execute the commands i uh, will see you in the next video till then bye bye take care